Oh! Startled me. Hi everybody, I'm Jim Williams from JimWilliamsOnTheAir.com and I'm literally off the air. Hey, that sounds like a good name for this video blog. Finally, a decent name for it, right? Uh, well, anyway, here we are. This is WSNJ in Bridgeton, New Jersey. This is where I work. I do Saturday mornings and weekday fill-in here, and I figured for this edition of the video blog, why don't I show you around my place of work? So let's take a tour together of the many, many facets that make up Quinn Broadcasting's WSNJ and WMVB AM in Bridgeton. Well, sorry about the pops in the audio. Well, here we are. Welcome, pop on in. This is the office area of our studios in Bridgeton. You can take a look past the reception desk. We have a bulletin board of lots of mementos. My mailbox is somewhere over there. There's the uh, boss's office. Should we go in? Yeah, probably not. I don't think so. It doesn't sound like a good idea. I don't think he'd want me in. Now we go in through this hallway, and we're getting close to the on-air studio. This is where Delaware Valley Hotline, our interview show, and some other shows are done. There's our banner. Lots of records back there. You'll see some of them close up in a second. We have an old boom mic from the 30s you just saw a moment ago. There's our production studio. I'll take you in there in a couple of minutes. And there's the auxiliary studio for WMVB, and we'll tell you about that in a few minutes as well. But this is where the magic happens. I feel like I'm in the middle of a bad episode of Radio Cribs or something. Anyway, here's the on-air studio at WSNJ. We have a computer. Had it for a couple of years, I think. We use mini discs, a couple of CD players, as you can see there. There are the mini discs. We use the weather for that. Phone off to the side. There's our board. There's the nice stereotypical radio mic and the boom. And you know we have cart machines still at the station. I'll show you more about that later. There's our CD player for the online cassette. Yeah, we have the uh, record players too. But this is the coup de gras. We still use on Saturdays a reel-to-reel -reel machine for certain programs. Yes, we never go out of style. And on top of the reel-to-reel. -reel, there you see, ow, uh, the old Mutual Networks News Alert box. Apparently, uh, SNJ back in the day was an affiliate of Mew Mew Mutual. Yeah, we use CDs too. There's a TV in the back. Very important because uh, on long days when I have to pull doubles, I would kill myself without the TV. And here are the records. We have literally hundreds, if not thousands, thousands, and thousands more different records. <laughs> Thank goodness I don't have to play any. Usually I use stuff in the computer or the occasional CD. All right, let's head out of here. Let's go. Next stop on our trip. Oh, you see a few more records there. Oh, here's an old picture on one of the walls. This is circa late 1930s, early 1940s, when we had sidewalk interviews on WSNJ. I actually took a microphone out in Bridgeton. Uh, probably not to this guy with a cigarette in his hand. I don't think he was the interviewer. Well, anyway, there you have it. Sidewalk interviews. We wouldn't have that. Uh, more contemporary, Polly Perrette. She's on NCIS. She's that punk rock looking gal. There's her badge. She came in to videotape something here at the studios. Jonathan P. Casey saw her. Lucky duck. Well, anyway, we moved down the hall. Let's go. There's the office again. There's the bulletin board of things. Lining the walls here, many awards from the community, and we're proud of them in SNJ. And now we're going to swing you around and into darkness. No, into the production room. <laughs> There's a shameless plug for Wonderf Energy. Well, anyway, here is our production room. Dan Morrow, our golden voice, usually here. Another reel-to-reel -reel setup for recording purposes. Another cart machine on the left. And we'll pan over there in a second. There it is. Uh, the eraser for those carts. Huh? Can't get enough of those carts. We'll show you some in a second. Here's the board in the production room. We have a computer for editing purposes. Most everything's in the computer these days. A couple of record players, phone for getting the weather, and yes, yes, you think we have carts? You think we have carts? Yeah, we have carts. Yeah, we're very neat and tidy at WSNJ, and another reel which I don't think we use right now. I'm not completely sure. Lots of wires, too. So, so here you are, the production room, the set player, mini discs again, which we use for weather and other purposes. It's a shame mini discs never really took off. Because, you know, I think they're a great piece of technology. We have a couple more cart machines in here. Okay, that's a production room. Let's go into the WMVB studios and show you what that's around. Oh, gotta move that door. One second. Boom. Alrighty, here we are inside the studios of WMVB. It's our auxiliary studio. We uh, still have a studio in Millville. Multiple microphones for recording purposes. Headphones. There's the board. CD players. Cassette player. Couple of carts. 
bunch of cards with jingles from WMVB that date back about 40 years unofficially. And yeah, we have a really big speaker in there. Real big speaker. And you gotta love the curtain, or whatever that is up top. And there's a program that we don't know the whole lot about. Well, anyway, this studio is primarily used on Sundays in the morning when MVB does their own religious programming. All right, let's go back and call this one a day. Well, there you have it. I hope you enjoyed the tour. I'm a decent tour guide at best, I guess you could say. But there's going to be more to come from here. You'll get to see me do some of my on-air shtick eventually, and so on and so forth. Hope you enjoyed. I'm Jim Williams, thanking you for stopping in off the air on JimWilliamsOnTheAir.com. Till next time, Jim Williams wishing you all whatever you wish yourself. I gotta get back on the air. I love this music, but I gotta talk about it. 1240, 1440, WSNJ, the sounds of Sinatra on the brush with old blue eyes.